हाय गाइस स्वागत है आपका हमारे यूट्यूब चैनल पे जहां पर हम इलेक्ट्रिक व्हीकल से जुड़ी सारी इंपॉर्टेंट न्यूज इवेंट्स और अपडेट डिस्कस करते हैं तो गाइस आज हमारे पॉडकास्ट पे हैं हमारे खास मेहमान मिस्टर विशाल वर्मा जो कि नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ डिजाइन आंध्र प्रदेश से उन्होंने ग्रेजुएशन करी है डिजाइनिंग में और ही रिसेंटली गॉट फेमस इन द न्यूज बिकॉज इन्होंने एम्बेसडर गाड़ी का इलेक्ट्रिक वर्जन उसका कंसेप्ट रीमेजिन किया उसका डिजाइन बनाया और यही चीज फिर न्यूज में भी प्रिंट हुई तो मैंने इनको कांटेक्ट किया लिंक पे क्योंकि मैं जानना चाहता था कि कि क्या चीज थी जिस यू नो जिसने इनको इंस्पायर किया था ये डिजाइन बनाने के लिए तो इनफैक्ट uh, uh, अभी हम आपको डिजाइन दिखाएंगे भी काफी अच्छा डिजाइन है उसमें एक रेट्रो वर्जन मेंटेन किया गया बट एट द सेम टाइम आपकी जो एमेस्टर गाड़ी है वो फ्यूचरिस्टिक uh, लग रही है सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल विशाल वेलकम टू द चैनल थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच थैंक यू फॉर इनवाइटिंग मी हियर तो सो मैं अपने दर्शकों को बताना चाहूंगा कि एम्बेसडर गाड़ी का जो प्रोडक्शन है वो तो रुक गया था 2014 में ही उसके बाद जो ब्रांड है वो एक फ्रेंच कंपनी को बेचती गई और उसके बाद ऑब्वियसली एम्बेसडर गाड़ी बनना और बिकना बंद हो गई इंडिया में लेकिन आई थिंक विशाल ने उसके ऊपर एक कंसेप्ट बनाया और उसका डिजाइन बनाया कि इलेक्ट्रिक एम्बेसडर कैसी दिखती है सो so, मैं विशाल ये पूछना चाहूंगा कि कैसे आप लाइक वर्ड गेव यू इंस्पिरेशन टू डिजाइन दी इलेक्ट्रिक वर्जन ऑफ एम्बेसडर सो आई विल स्टार्ट विद लाइक टेलिंग व्हाई व्हाई आई डिजाइन दिस सो एज एन इंडस्ट्रियल डिजाइनर आई एम वेरी मच इनटू ऑटोमोबाइल डिजाइन आल्सो बिकॉज़ फ्रॉम क्लास 9 आई एम परसुइंग लाइक कि आई वांट टू बिकम अ कार डिजाइनर so for that i keep uh, doing car sketches and reimagining cars how they will be look like so for us uh, as a designer it's very important to imagine things uh, how it look like how it look how it feel the interaction with the day okay? so if we, why i design ambassador because this is the car which i used to sit on and used to go around with my father so i know this car from inside out and how i know how it look how it feel and as you can say this ambassador is also a status symbol during its time uh, not everybody can buy this particular car in certain areas only politicians and these people are driving this mm-hmm. so during this lockdown period i got this idea why not to design the luxury version why not to design the high end version of this car with little tweak of future ke adding electronics uh, and uh, creating this particular car into a electric car and seeing uh, many news is over like ki uh, like uh, india making made in india yeah. and uh, independent india like if we can make our own products and all right right uh, so uh so is okay so uh when you okay so mai ek bar darshakon ko design dikha deta hu jo aapne banaya hai and sure. so that they can also have a look at it so here is the design which vishal made uh and uh so we'll go one by one on the uh how did the designing process come about इसमें कौन से इंस्पिरेशन आपने करी हैं क्या मूड बोर्ड रहा होगा इस डिजाइन का तो वो सब चीजें तो गाइस जैसा कि आप देख पा रहे हैं बहुत ही फ्यूचरिस्टिक और स्लीक डिजाइन है इसको देख के आपको पुराने एम्बेसडर की भी याद आती है लाइट्स देख के प्लस आगे के कर्व्स देख के बट इसको एक स्लीक और एक फ्यूचरिस्टिक वर्जन जो है दिया गया है प्लस ऑब्वियसली आप देख पा रहे हैं कि वहाँ पे चार्जिंग स्टेशन है बिकॉज दिस इज एन इलेक्ट्रिक कार लेट मी जस्ट गो बियॉन्ड दिस एंड यू कैन सी that there is a retractable rear camera chrome a pillar gold school design uh, chrome side lines wheel cover and charging port aapne piche ki taraf diya right yes okay and uh, this is the inside of the uh, car which definitely looks pretty luxurious as he has stated that he wanted to make a luxurious version of ambassador and तो बताइए विशाल और क्या क्या खासियत है इस डिजाइन में सो इफ यू गो लाइक अप प्लीज गो अप लिटिल बिट सो वी स्टार्ट विद द ऑल ओवर नो लिटिल बिट मोर अप सो लाइक दिस दिस इज द होल वन थर्ड व्यू ऑफ दैट कार पर्सपेक्टिव व्यू वेयर यू कैन सी हाउ इट रिजेंबल द ओल्ड एंबेसडर 
so yeah. whenever we think of future design we always try to think something which is totally out of the box yeah. but here i want to connect people with the name of the car and the brand so i didn't go too beyond like yeah, i'm not going to change the whole design so right. i take the take the initial silhouette of the car and did minimal tweaking with the how it will uh, give the more futuristic and bold look at the same time give the luxury feel of sleekness so for that for being like if you see old uh, ambassador you will see it look like a bulky product but when you see this particular uh, what i design is i play with lines uh, here with where mm-hmm. you can see like on the on the base side you see yeah. there's a strong uh, line which yeah. goes from starting to wheel cap no right. on the rear cap you see one straight line yeah. which what it doing it it's cutting the bottom part so you see the whole car is looking very sleek because of that because yeah. the bottom part is getting darker so yeah. because of that, the people don't see that they only see the highlighted area so they see much longer car and much shorter view like the so, the height okay. is okay cool so that line yeah. is helping me uh, perceive it as if it is not that uh that, in that depth at all yeah yeah so yeah. Uh, though it is but it still kind of gives me uh, that actually yeah. now that you're saying i'm noting it uh, yeah, right, yeah, yeah. Right. so these so are certain the paint like, is the paint is the paint darker or is it just the shadow or no, is it it's, it's like if you see there is a white highlight so yeah. because light is falling in that particular part and that area is catching more of the light so because of that the bottom part get darker so oh, okay. when the bottom part get darker you don't see that particular part and you'll right. see much sleeker car but it is not it is at the same height only and same the volume is same but with the line i changed the whole dimension how you see the car cool cool like, great great yes. and, and uh, yeah and so i want to create that retro feeling as well so retro feeling how you will get the retro feel yeah. whenever you see the old car you see the chrome chrome yeah. is the very important like a friend of the old cars and yeah. you can say that so right. i use that particular thing in the side view where you can see a line chrome strip is going around with the car not fully but okay. till the second because i am not disturbing the uh, original curve of the uh, back curve of that particular ambassador which is very iconic in terms of if i remove it you can't perceive it as a ambassador right, so like right. that even yeah. for that uh, i also add one bold look into this car by adding the a pillar as a thick unit with a uh, chrome chrome styling so mm-hmm. which gives you it, it depends what what kind of person is owning this they can go through a matte chrome they can go through a glossy chrome and even if it is used as a politician car we can like it gives a certain style statement like if we are not that backward till now we are also very much forward in terms of design so yeah. we use that old feature as a new complementary design for the car okay at the same time you uh, i maintain the front uh, like on the bonnet there is a chrome strip i maintain that which is very much iconic in terms of uh, hm uh, thing and uh, the re- retractable mirror is because to give it the futuristic uh, feeling because there are certain uh, things uh, yeah so when you move down i i listed certain features over here where you can see uh, there's a side uh, indicator which is incorporated in that uh, chrome lining which yeah. is very much complementing with that line and give a value to that particular line and with that i added the chrome and the uni window uni window which gives you a more longer feel of the car okay. the car look more longer and a unified body but still there is a two window two there are two glasses but there is no partition here that's what you're saying no partition because the glass is covering the whole surface over there so it so, look very uh... sleek and all right cool yeah and, and what do we mean by suicide door suicide doors are something like that suppose you are moving in the fast car uh, like your car is moving fast direction you can't open that door if you open that that door because of the air it will broke and take you off from the car like that because mm-hmm. it's open in the opposite direction 
okay it's not opening in the uh, car moving direction it opens in the opposite direction okay. movement direction so, so yeah it's quite why so you chose okay so let me just see that you were saying that the doors oh the rear right. door is a suicide door yeah the rear door is the suicide door so, so when the car is open you see the full picture like you see the full cabin at once yeah where it gives you more room more luxury because luxury uh, the term luxury i take i this is more over like inspired from rolls royce how they use their doors and the things like you to create is there any benefit space. of this kind of door like uh, from a bar from aesthetic perspective is it uh, from a user uh, yes so point? what i did what i did here is i imagine this car like 10 years ahead from now or 5 years ahead so here is a display is going on suppose a person who is sitting behind and he wants to check out certain details and he want to see where the car is moving where what particular mails he get so he can use that particular side rail the touch screen or visual so he mm-hmm. can move around he can do his stuff over there at the same time he is having some glove box there to put their es- essential and things and speakers mm-hmm. are mounted over there okay yes and uh, about the charging point yeah we can go down one thing i want to ask is that you have given charging point in a very a uh, different location which is on the top usually electric cars have a charging point and the literal side. in the front yeah that is the main point uh, why i did that because if you use the ambassador you see the ambassador fuel point is there only so oh. it kinds of nostalgia which is creating it either either you are u- using a new car new electric car but you are refilling at the same point ye mujhe nahi pata so for the first you upar hota yeah so suppose a person who is driving this car for 10 years he know where the fuel part is subconsciously so for uh, okay. like for the old person they can interact it in the old ways with the new car so this is the whole interaction part of this particular car cool cool how cool. yeah so is there any type of charging point you imagine because they are like uh, the cars have like an ac charger and a dc charger in in that sense But but have you thought about it? Abi because there are like uh, like a Hyundai Kona, जो आपकी गाड़ी आती है उसमें CCS और Type Two charger होता है और जो आपकी yes. पुरानी गाड़ियाँ हैं Mahindra E Two वो Mahindra Verito Tata Tiger उसमें आपका GBT use होता है और जो भारत AC zero zero one AC charger but uh, I think uh, आपने charging point ऐसा चाबी आपने flexible रखा है इसमें कि there is no specific uh, charging point you have used. No, no. no it's not that much okay. specific it's just a design render shall we go to the interior render yeah sure sure we can move so this is little bit more interesting uh, because okay. in terms of driving and everything you see this is a whole new there is not much going on in the interior because driver should be much focused on the road what he is driving at and okay. uh, here you can see one display right now which is retractable display right now it's showing you certain detail your speed your charging how much kilometer you run mm-hmm. and you see the one very important did you see the ac vent there that grill yeah so this is something you see which is little bit unique you can't see those scrollers and everything there mm-hmm. because it's a mesh which is unidirectional it's multidirectional so there is no fight of like e- either shift karo udhar shift karo you just on the ac it will directly spread your things in every direction if you zoom it in the middle of that dashboard just below the yeah this particular segment you see the mesh yeah this is yeah. a mesh it's for ac and below there is a very uh, like you can know okay so from charge. from distant it looked like a flat but when i zoomed in now it looks like it is horizontal and then vertical okay yeah so multiple design multiple folds are there which throw your rear in different direction which like uh, it's and the much mesh better. also you have made uh, it's not it's it the mesh itself has those curves and curve yeah yeah 
so yeah, what it's in oh, okay that is actually amazing is, is is it there in 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 some of the cars or is it i don't think so it's, it's so, i don't think so <laughs> so it's like that is an amazing idea so you're saying that the mesh is there and instead of just throwing in one direction i give the different shapes to the mesh horizontal yeah. vertical and when the air comes out it, it chooses the direction uh, yeah it goes in direction according what to if, what if what if i what if i want ac only in my legs i don't want it on my face so in legs there are certain places there are ac vents which is behind the dashboard not uh-huh. in the front okay okay Those but what if what if i want what if my wife wants ac but i don't want ac so there is another small vent also on the side <laughs> <laughs> this is something like taking all the roof ah, okay oh, nice this is actually a good idea man yeah right. and there is uh, behind that there is a indian thing glove box to put your storage like you can put your files there why is you it an indian your... thing because indian very much requires something to store they always yeah, like gaadi ke rc rc ka rakhenge fir gaadi ka paper pollution insurance wo bhi to nahi hai all right right theek hai shall we move down now so, and see? now this is the second part of that particular steering suppose mm-hmm. now you are very much uh, like comfortable you are in entertainment mode ki okay i am driving on a highway and i want to enjoy mm-hmm. like i want to see the routes the then the whole screen is divided into three the flat okay. will this is retra- retractable when mm. you need one focus driving the whole screen go behind each other but when you know where to drive what is the map and everything the still will divide into three parts like behind the screen there is one more flap understood understood so like that yeah so you so have not have given a traditional uh da- that analog thing speed wala wo you know not given dial dial no 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 dialers no that is actually because so, you want people to not focus on multiple things right now in my car i have a dashboard i have a speedometer and uh, fuel and then i also yeah. use maps so it's yeah actually very distracting so, sometime like uh, when you are driving in a like uh, in a congested area so then you your focus should be on the road not uh, adjusting your screen and everything so it is like yeah. you want a focus mode driving there is no three screen there is one screen only but you are into a leisure mode where you are open roads and you want to adjust your uh, like environment and you want to play some music so you can open like these three will uh, open it and you can adjust it according to yourself like that this. is good maps and entertainment and there is control yeah. panel like that so it will go like back like this i showed the image Okay, where the single screen, how it open it up and become three screen display, like this. And this is some uh, renders like showing in the views only. Okay. Final like yes. That is actually really, really some really nice uh, designing work, and uh. So that is cool, actually, and uh, uh, that's what I. I was just wanting to show you that how it was made and what was the thought process in a designer's mind that I would like to start how to start. And I think Vishal has also shared with me his his college project, in which he has made a security truck, which is very amazing. Okay. वो भी हम कवर करेंगे बट अगली वीडियो में बट इसमें मैं आपको ये डिजाइन दिखाना चाहता था कि थोड़ा सा जिनको एम्बेसडर जिन्होंने चलाई है या देखी है तो उनके लिए काफी ज्यादा हो सकता है एक नॉस्टेलजिया क्रिएटिंग हो इनफैक्ट मैं तो कहूंगा कि यू शुड सेंड दिस डिजाइन टू द फ्रेंच कंपनी प्यूजो आई होप आई एम प्रोनाउंसिंग इट राइट विच नाउ इज द ओनर ऑफ द एम्बेसडर ब्रांड सो यू शुड एक्चुअली सेंड इट टू देम एंड लेट सी वॉट है and uh, so guys i hope aapko acha laga ho ye video so vishal keep doing the good work and uh, you know uh, keep making good designs uh, and i hope you you know you really do good in the field of uh, evs or automation uh, automotive industry thank you okay guys okay chalo guys uh, bye this is for it today uh, see in the next video